Takže ahoj lidi, vidíte u dalšího videa. Takže tohle video je o tom, že vlastně jdeme hledat Virgila. Má to být vědec, který nám pomůže se dostat nějakým způsobem do institutu. Takže vlastně teďka projedeme to kolečko. Osobně tady tohle videjko jsem zkrátil o hodně, protože je tam hodně sen, které jsou zbytečné, je tam hodně toho, co, jsou, co je zbytečné. Dohromady by to mělo hodinu 30 minut a já jsem to zkrátil na 13. Takže super. Tak jo, tak si to užijte. You know damn well I am. What are you doing here? Whoa! What the hell are you? First time seeing a super mutant, hmm? You've led a sheltered life. It wasn't exactly my best idea, but turning into one of these hulking monstrosities was the only way to... Huh? Well, to get here, at least I avoided some of the side effects and retained my faculties. But that's not the point. What are you doing here? What do you want? Can you tell me about the Institute or not? The Institute? So, they did send you, didn't they? You're working with Kellogg. Why are you so afraid of Kellogg? Do you have any idea what that man has done? What the Institute pays him to do? It's all off the book stuff. The man is a killer. And he's very good at what he does. A já mu vlastně řeknu, že jsem zabil Kelloga a že se právě ptám na ten institut, protože se tam chci dostat jednoduše. Alright, let's talk details. First things first. You know how synths get in and out of the institut? Yeah, they use some sort of teleporter. Well, well. Not many know about it. Pretty closely guarded secret. You've certainly done your homework. It's commonly referred to as the molecular relay. I don't understand all the science behind it, but it works. Dematerializes you in one place, rematerializes you in another. I'm sure it sounds crazy, but it's a reality. The relay is the only way in and out of the Institute. You understand? The only one. That means you're going to have to use it. Now, have you ever seen an Institute courser? Sure. Lots of them. Don't bullshit. Osobně, co se týče zabití lovce Institutu, tak jsem zabil vlastně jenom dva lovce. A to jednoho omylem. Když jsem trefil raketomet vedle něj, tak jsem ho zabil. A vlastně pak jsem zabil toho lovce, který vlastně šel vysvobodit tu základní variantu toho synteta, tu K1. Are you here for the sin? What sin? If you're not here for the sin, then you're here for me. What? 
do you want? I need what's in your head. That you cannot have. There's been panic about the new thing floating in the sky. <laughs> I thought it was one of Tinker Tom's aliens. Aliens are real! Enough! The blimp is called the Pridwin, and it's operated by the Brotherhood of Steel. The Brotherhood of Steel are a formidable, highly advanced order. And they've come here to destroy since. Shit! Spread the word. The Brotherhood are our enemies. There's no possibility of peace. Tinker Tom will be spearheading a fail-safe plan to deal with this Brotherhood. Codename, Red Glare. But for now, we monitor them and keep them clear of our operations. The focus remains on the Institute. You've all got jobs to do. Do them. I have a report here. It reads more like a comic book. Apparently, one hell of a fight took place at Green Tech Genetics. Yeah, that was me. I took down a courser. That's what the report says. Hard to believe. I'm all for one less courser in the world, but the conventional wisdom is that you run from them rather than engage them. So why did you kill him? I needed a courser chip. I need the code on it. You have one of their chips intact? Follow me. Now. Decoding a Courser chip is a very delicate operation. Diggins' record is the best. The least of which you is can learn a lot here. from him. Fortunately, we have the right man for the job. Hey, dude. You need something? Tom, we got a Courser chip. Whoa! For real? Oh, man, it's been ages! You've hit the jackpot with this. Hand over the chip. Let's see what's on it. Here you go. All right. Tom, make it happen. All right, little Corsa Chip. Let's have the circuit analyzer take a crack at you. You from one of those vaults? I have the code. Suppose I shouldn't be surprised. You did get rid of Kellogg, after all. Not too much of a leap to take down a courser. How'd you manage to get it decoded? The railroad helped me. Oh god, those kooks. I would have expected they'd be too busy trying to liberate vending machines, or setting computer terminals free, or... Sorry. They just have something of a reputation. 
You're not the only one who's been busy. I did the best I could. From memory and things I've overheard through the years. Came up with some schematics for you. Wasn't easy. These hands are ridiculous. Fine motor skills have gone to shit. Here's the symbol explanation. You need to build a device that will hijack the signal the Institute uses to teleport coursers and send you instead. You know the craziest part of the design? That classical music station. That's the carrier signal for the relay. All the data's on harmonic frequencies. You've been hearing it all along. I want to be clear that this isn't my area of expertise. I was bioscience, not engineer. If a stranger ever comes up to you and gives you a back-breaking bear hug, that's our runner. She Pam wants you. Worship. She explained why, but I couldn't figure it out. How do you even fit down here in that? Agent. A new DIA cache has been identified. Assistance requested in recovery. I can recover it. Location of cache being transmitted to your Pip-Boy. Conversation terminated. Do you need something? plans here to build a signal interceptor that can get me into the Institute. So that's what the Courser chip was all about. You needed that frequency, I take it. Why? What does this machine do? Did you know the Institute has a teleporter called the Molecular Relay? We've spent dozens of years and too many good agents' lives only to discover not a goddamn thing. And now we have the answer, thanks to you. Teleportation. That the Institute could build something so... <sighs> but we've got work to do. This is our top priority now. I want Tinker Tom to help you in any way possible to get this device built. Uh, sorry, Tinker Tom's got me doing... something. Tak jo, a teďka víme, jak to je a příště bude následovat další část.